Hello, and welcome to Bipolar Opposite. My name is Tim Cubbin, and I am your host for this program. First off, I, you, my viewers, need to know a few things about myself and about this program. I think it best to explain the condition I'm living with. I am living with bipolar disorder. I do not say I'm bipolar, or I have bipolar disorder. This says that the bipolar condition defines me, and that is who I am, and that's just not the case. So I say I'm living with bipolar disorder. I'm not ashamed to share the condition I'm living with. I was diagnosed with having bipolar disorder 12 years ago. I am heavily medicated, but I'm not going to wallow in self-pity. It's not who I am. Is living with bipolar disorder a struggle? Yes. By I take my medications? I see a psychiatrist, I was voluntarily hospitalized on a mental unit, and I was in the program twice in 2014, but the point is, I seek help. So I say to anyone that with any kind of illness, mental or physical, that you can live a full life, as long as you know that you are not your illness, you are battling your illness, your illness. Live as you. So you are living condition. It doesn't define who you are. Okay, I know I must be sounding a bit repetitive, but I think these points are so important, I have to reiterate them enough to all get it. Okay, now I'm going to talk about this show. You're probably wondering, you probably got it around up to that, to the title, the title Bipolar, so you might be wondering where Opposites comes from. It really didn't have much meaning originally, I just thought that one of Bipolar in the title, and there is the phrase Polar Opposites, so, bipolar opposite sounds cool, but it also has to do with looking at the subject from both ways, so pretty clever, yeah? So now I'll explain the point of the show. This is be a weekly news program. If any of you saw the season one of Bipolar Opposites, you know that I talk about mental health conditions. While this is now a news program, mental health will be talked about. This show will be presented in six clips. Clip one, this one, is my introduction. Clip 2 is a serious news story. Clip 3 is a human interest news story. Clip 4 is an entertainment news story. Clip 5 is media about wellness and other topics pertaining to physical and mental disorders. And 6, you guessed it, the conclusion. So, what could I possibly have to say to get you to watch any more of this show? Clip 2, heroin, ep heroin epidemic. Clip 3, confused lion slayer. Clip 4, Better for United. The five DBT. If you all want to know more about what the hell that is, watch this clip. So, if any of this, um, all of this interests you, and you got, go to the proper clip. If not, well, frankly, who really cares? But feel free to keep going. 